In this video, I'll show you how to create person schema for a person on your WordPress website. Welcome to All-in-One SEO. We make SEO easy with our powerful WordPress SEO plugin. Let's get started. So what is person schema and why would you want it on your WordPress website? Well, if we do a quick search here for Steve Jobs, the Wikipedia page for Steve Jobs comes up, all these results for Steve Jobs comes up, but we also have this panel over here on the right with more information about Steve Jobs displayed directly in the Google search result. So it is schema code embedded in the Wikipedia webpage that allows this information to be displayed by Google. So if you include schema data on a person in your organization, you have a chance of having that information displayed here. So the first thing we're gonna do is install the all-in-one SEO plugin. If you already have AIO SEO installed, you can skip ahead to the next part of the video using the timestamps below. So let's go ahead and click on plugins and then click on the button that says add new. If you haven't done so already, we're going to want to download the plugin from AIOSEO.com. You're going to go to the account section into your download area and click the big green button that says download AIO SEO. And if you don't have an account already, you should be able to create one pretty easily. So back on the plugins page of your WordPress website, we're going to go ahead and click the Upload Plugin button, and then click Choose File, and choose the plugin file that you just downloaded. And then click the Install Now button. After the plugin installs, click the blue button that says Activate Plugin. After the plugin installs and is activated, the AIO SEO Setup Wizard will pop up automatically. We have another video that walks you through these steps, and I highly encourage you to go through that wizard because it will just set up your whole website for success as far as your SEO efforts go. But for now, we're going to head back to the dashboard. And then if you scroll on down the page and click the link, there's a space for us to enter our all-in-one SEO Pro license key. Back on our AIO SEO account, which you can find at aioseo.com slash account. Make sure you're on the Downloads tab, and then next to where it says License Key, if you click on the icon, it will copy out our All-in-One SEO Pro License Key. And then we're going to paste the License Key into the License Key field, click Connect, and that's it. All-in-One SEO Pro is activated on this website. If you want to be doubly sure, you can go ahead and click the blue Save Changes button. And then we're going to scroll up and click on the dashboard link just so we're all on the same page. So now that you have All-in-One SEO installed, or maybe you've had it installed for some time now, let's head on over to the post section here. And I'm going to click on this post called Matt Author. So this is a demo post about me. We're going to pretend my last name is Author. And this is some demo information about me. If we scroll down past the content of that post, to the all-in-one SEO settings section. We can click on the tab up top that says schema, and then click on the big blue button that says generate schema. And here's all the different types of schema we have available. We have some other videos on some of these types of schema. So if you're interested in product schema, you'll see a link right now on the screen. You can click on that and go to the product schema video. We've got another one on recipe schema. You can check out that video. We've also got one on FAQ schema, so if you're interested in that, you can check out that video. But for this video, we're talking about person schema, so I'm going to go ahead and click on the plus icon here to add the person schema to the page. The first thing it's asking me is for the name. I'm going to use the post title because the title was Matt Author. That's exactly what I want. For the description, I'm going to go ahead and use post excerpt. And then this is where you fill in the details of this person for the person schema. So obviously only fill out this information if you have permission or if you want it to be publicly available. And we are going to put video author. And then for image, I'm going to grab this image of Steve Jobs from my image library. And then we can also put in a address. And when we're done filling out that information, click the blue button that says Add Schema. 
and that schema will be added to your page. So you can see here it says schema in use. We have article and person. I'm going to go ahead and throw out the article schema, which was added by default because this is a person and I want to use the person schema that I just created. I'm going to confirm. Yes, I want to delete this schema. And then I'm going to click the blue update button here so I update the page that the schema has been added to. And that's it. You have successfully added person schema data to this page. And now you have a chance of having rich snippets about the person in your organization show up directly in Google search results. So that's how to create person schema. If you don't already have our awesome all-in-one SEO plugin installed, we've got a link to it in the description below this video. It can help you out with the task in this video as well as many other SEO jobs that you might have to do on your WordPress website. If you click on this next video right here, I'll show you how to build internal links fast with Link Assistant. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tips and tricks on how to use our easy and powerful WordPress SEO plugin, all-in-one SEO.